Thanks, Steve. In this week's edition of Authors Revealed, Becky Anderson sat down with Jocelyn Jackson to discuss her newest novel, Someone Else's Love Story. Jackson's latest book is about learning that things aren't always what they seem or what we'll hope they'll be. It's a story about discovering what we want and finding what we need. It's Authors Revealed. I'm Becky Anderson. We have New York Times best-selling author Jocelyn Jackson and her new book is called Someone Else's Love Story. You gotta read it. You won't be able to put it down. So what are you hearing from your readers, your fans about someone else's love story? Good stuff so far. I mean, it's been kind of yeah. a weird time to release a book because it's right in the middle of the Thanksgiving holiday, right. so. Your tour had a break. and Yeah, and everybody's on vacation, yeah, sure, so I've, sure. I feel like I'm, I'm just sort of yeah. floating amorphously in space, but I've been hearing like, I keep getting emails from like weird places where I don't think of myself as that, like Vermont and Hawaii. I've gotten emails about this book. Oh, interesting. People, yeah, right, right. So I don't know. I mean, so far, and the reviews have been stellar. Like, no, they have I'm been. waiting I, I for read a hammer to drop. I, no, 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 no. No, it, it, no and, and it's so deserved. The book was, oh, was fabulous. You. So Dr. William Ash, the yes. character in this. What an interesting guy. Brilliant mind, but it has, you know, that, that Asperger's yes. aspect to him. Um, how did you write him? Because you're writing from a different kind of angle. I guess, I mean, one of the things I wanted to do with William was... Um, I wanted to have a character who was on the autism spectrum in a book that wasn't at all about being on the autism right, spectrum. Right, exactly. But he, that's just part of who he is. And I think that's kind of where we are now. Those people are so successful in a lot of cases. Yes, that's right. They're marrying, they're having kids. Those genes are, that's evolution, baby. Yeah. Those genes are sure. useful in a lot of ways, yeah, so we're seeing right, more and more of it. Right. And that's just how a lot of people are. This book, to me, it's all about... You know, it has some those religious themes in it, but to me, mm -hmm. it's more about having faith and having faith in each other. I think it's because faith is so incredibly powerful, right. and yeah. because it's so powerful, it can be used against you in really terrible ways, or it can be an amazing force for human-driven good. Right. And right. and that's what I was interested in in the book was looking at the way. At, at how faith is used and misused by people. Great conversation. What fun we've just had with New York Times bestselling author Jocelyn Jackson about her new novel. It's called Someone Else's Love Story. Thanks for joining me on Authors Revealed. Thanks, Becky. If you're interested in the full interview with Jocelyn Jackson, visit nctv17.com for a list of airtimes.